So even though we face the difficulties of today and tomorrow, I still have a dream. It is a dream deeply rooted in the American dream. I have a dream that one day this nation will rise up and live out the true meaning of its creed. We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. Yeah. Every single year on Martin Luther King Day, I always think about one thing. One thing about the life of Dr. Martin Luther King stands out to me and causes me to think and remember the impact that he has had on our world and on our lives and on my life. And that is his amazing, unbelievable, I have a dream speech that he gave during one of the most amazing civil rights marches in our modern time. And the reason that stands out to me so much is the power of his words of saying, I have a dream. And he talked about having a dream of a world where white children and black children, where white culture and black culture could come together and be one. I was inspired by him as a young man as I watched this man so powerfully use his voice to communicate the dream he had for this world and probably not even realizing he was teaching young boys like me to dream about a future they wanted to have. And then eventually one day, I too had a dream where I dream about a world where hope and optimism are more viral, meaning they travel faster and throughout more homes and into more people's lives and into more people's hearts than hate and problems. I truly dream of a world where people are more happy and fulfilled and joyous than we're overwhelmed, anxious, and struggling. I've been working on this dream for so long as I've traveled the world teaching people how to do solution-focused grief therapy, which is based in hope, love, and optimism. You know, I'm out here right now in Los Angeles, California, where this dream is beginning to take hold, and I can't help but thank Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. for inspiring a young me. I'm not sure that I would be here if not for the inspiration I had as a young person. I so desperately want this world to be more positive. I so desperately want this world to be filled with more joy, love, and happiness. But we are really struggling. We're living in times unlike any other time in my lifetime and any other lifetime before. It's scary what is going on in this world, but I still think love is the powerful tool. Love is the powerful weapon to take hold and overcome all of these struggles. We have to remember the people like Dr. Martin Luther King who said, I have a dream, and then he worked feverishly to make his dream come true. If you can have a dream, you can work to make it come true. And I'm out here in Los Angeles where we're working on some things where we can truly put love, hope, and optimism in every home. And I wanna thank Martin Luther King for inspiring me to also have a dream. <laughs>